It's a big baby boom happening at Zoo Tampa and Lowry Park. Four different animal moms have given birth recently. It's really sweet. Our Sean Daly paid a visit to the adorable new residence and brought along one of his own babies to enjoy the fun. Hello everybody, this is Sean Daly at Zoo Tampa, Lowry Park, and look who I brought with me today. Surprise America. It's my daughter Ava Daly. What are you doing here today? I had no responsibilities today, so I came to check out some baby animals. Let's go see them. Come on. Spring is a really fun time for us at the zoo. We tend to have babies around springtime. Tiffany Burns is the senior director of animal programs at Zoo Tampa, and she is giving us the baby tour. Four new moms have given birth at the zoo recently. So welcome to the world, playful red wolf pups. Fuzzy little lorikeets, a shy bay diker named Juniper, Think small antelope and a Nyala named Finn. Think big antelope. Well, someday. It's really important for us, not just because they're adorable and they're cute and they're fun to watch grow up, but really important for us from a conservation standpoint. Fair warning, the new lorikeets and Juniper the Diker are pretty private right now. So guests have the best chance of getting good looks at the red wolf pups and my daughter's favorite, the Nyala. His name is Finn. He's a total diva. Very difficult to work with. He much prefers the shade, but I'm the same way, so <laughs> who can blame him? We also have Dad, Orion, coming up. He's majestic. That's Sean Daly if he was a zoo animal. <laughs> the best time to see the new zoo babies? Right when the zoo opens at feeding time. At Zoo Tampa at Lowry Park, I am Sean Daly, ABC Action News.